freaking clobber carrot. It's talking about the others. What are they doing here, I wonder? What? Is that it? Huh, that's fucking weird. I do sense some manner of presence and came to investigate. My senses alone cannot tell friend from foe, so I decided to approach cautiously. Then Agumon arrived and simply charged forward with reckless abandon. Yeah, I can see that. I feel like I should apologize for Agumon. Agumon is convinced there's no danger, but I recommend caution in any case. It's not a phone thing. Oh. Yeah, search the suspicious thicket. Look, look, Takuma! There's something there! Whoa! Something has jumped out! Oh, it's Gumamon. Hello. What's with that thing? Are you sure it's not gonna attack? It appears wary of our presence. Look, it's hurt. Maybe that's why it's upset. It's been glaring at us this whole time. What should we do, Takuma? Shouldn't we treat its wounds? That's probably why it's so agitated. You're so kind, Takuma. You sound just like Aoi. Are you sure? This creature's wounded. It might try to fight back. It looks scared of us. Maybe it's the injury. I'm sure it'll, it'll see we mean no harm if we take it slow and steady. Oh, cool, a free Gomamon. That's actually pretty neat. This is what I said, pretty cool, is I think if you don't time out right the free time, you won't get this event. Yeah, 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 of course. So what happens if I go talk to Kunamon again? Cute. Well, all right then. I presume there is just literally nothing left to do except talk to Lopmon. It's Lopmon, but Shuji's nowhere to be seen. Hello, huh, Lotmon? What are you doing in here? Are you by yourself? Yeah. Where's Shuji? I tried calling for him, but he won't answer me. Oh, sounds like you've got problems of your own. Takuma, how do you feel about us? Huh? You mean about you, Agumon, and the others? Right. Dude, trusting partners. You guys are trustworthy partners. That's what I think. You're always there to help when we're having a hard time. You're like our monster saviors. It's all thanks to you that we're alive right now. Well, maybe that's true for you and Agumon. Isn't it true for you, too? I don't know. Lamon is concerned about his relationship with Shuji. I know that, but there's no way I could know what to say that would help them. All I can do is say how I feel. Lamon doesn't seem satisfied, but what else is there to say? Anyway, I think that free time was too fucking long and way too much fucking talking. I did not need to ask every fucking character every little thing they cared about to get the affinity boost. That was... It's absurd that it made me do that. It's almost lunchtime. Better get back to... Takuma! Agumon, you're back. Takuma, this is huge! You won't believe it! I won't believe what? It's really big and shiny and just unbelievable! Big and shiny? What are you talking about? Uh, what was it Falcomon called it? Oh, right! A radio! Tawa! Oh, radio tower. Uh, we need to understand their characters and motivations. I will never know what the spirit lantern is. A what? Oh, you mean a radio tower? Beep, 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 beep. Contacting based world. I quickly got everyone together, and they were all thrilled by Agumon's discovery. Those towers send cell signals too, right? If we go there, our phones might stop working. And I bet from a tall building like that, we could get a great view of our surroundings. Anime executives, <laughs> sir, I don't know if we can fit 10 hours of character development in episode 3. 
Sure you can. Haven't you seen what the new season of Stranger Things did? Just how tall is it? You wanna know what Spirit Lamp is? I guess! I don't even know why Ultra fucking brought it up if I was never gonna find it again. Because he was like, I'm gonna mention it and then not tell you what it is. And also, you just missed it permanently. It's super tall! Falcomon, you saw it too, right? How tall would you say it was? Well, it's hard to say with no comparison, but it was taller than the school. If it's that big, then there's no doubt. Do you think it's working? That I do not know. After all, none of us have even heard of these towers before. Well, if I, like, I lost the voice for a second. If we went there, we could find out. Who knows? Maybe there's someone there. Like, yeah, sitting around talking about it isn't going to do us much good. Then it sounds like we're in for a hike. Let's do the sound. A hike? What do you mean? What kind of hike? Oh, didn't you know? You didn't know? The tower is on top of a mountain, through the forest and over a mountain pass. Wait, you mean we need to go through the forest? You can't be serious. This place is crawling with monsters. Just exploring around here would be risky. So what he told me is that there's a sequence of events you could have involved that... You could that involve that vinegar you found before, and it gives you an item that ends the spider boss first phase right away. Okay, that's neat. I don't know why the fuck he didn't just tell me about it, since that's very clearly something I will never get the chance to get to again. But you want to go climb a mountain? There's no way! We should stay here! Uh, Shuji, you don't have to get so upset. Shut up, I don't want to hear another word from you. It doesn't matter. Nothing we do matters. Can't. Say what you want on Chuji, but nothing's gonna change if we just stay here. Look at a bunch of kids do. We need to wait for the adults to come rescue us. As if anyone's ever come to the fucking truth. Yeah, Shuji, you said it yourself. Nobody's coming for us. I never said that, not out loud. If I did, that might make it come true. Even knowing there wasn't much chance of rescue, none really, sh uh, none really. Shuji still hoped. Can we just not listen to Shuji? I'm, I'm going with you, Labramon. Will you come with me? You bet I will, Aoi. Wait, Aoi, I thought you agreed we should stay here. If, if that tower is a cell signal, that would mean we could contact a teacher. We could talk to everyone, even call for help. Call for help? Yes, and then wait to be rescued. Are you really still against this, Shuji? You tell him, Aoi, and hey, that means now a majority of us want to go explore. I'm interested in this tower, too. That puts me, Minoru, Saki, and Aoi in favor of going. So what now, Shuji? But, no. Shuji must really not want to go back out there if he's still not convinced. If only there were some way to win him over. Why was he so opposed to exploration again? Because we might get attacked. Agumon, did you spot anything that seemed dangerous or that might attack us on the way? Not to worry, we didn't get attacked once! I didn't catch a whiff of anything suspicious either. So it's not dangerous? It sounds like a no-brenner. You really think it's safe? I guess in that case... Uh, well, if you all want to go, I guess there's no point in me trying to stop you. Okay, everyone, bye! Bye. What are you two talking about? You're coming with us. But what will you do if a monster attacks and it's just the two of you? And let's not forget, neither of you have a part in a monster. Indeed, we will not let any harm come to you. No man left behind. And I'll help keep you safe, too. Like, never one to be left out, are you? Yeah, all Gumon's are like this all the time. Oh, and Rio, you'll look after the place while we're gone, won't you? Wait, don't you go leaving me behind? What the fuck was your voice? Hey, man, don't go leaving me behind. I'm going too, okay? Oh, come on, Rio. How are you so uncooperative if you can't handle being on your own? Oh, it's alright. At least he's finally back to being the Rio we know. Oh, we gotta leave the kids behind. Haru, Mizuki, and Rio. He's been a little off lately, but the guy's supposed to be bitter and crappy. 
It's a Krabby. Dude, that's for true city. Oh, Dunks is baby. He says, I'm tired. Sleep. Following directions from Agumon and the others, we emerge on a mountain path. I really thought the kids were going to argue about coming with us, but I guess they just came with ease. No. The Mothman Bridge. Hard to believe this place was right here, so close to the school. Oh, fuck, wait, did we actually just leave them? Yeah, it's just a little to the left of the shrine, and yet it feels so different. We're a big group, and Haru's a little kid, but we still made it under an hour. Never mind. We took everyone. They're just not in the shot. This drop goes really far down. It's not too steep, but it would still be a nasty fall. Hey, look. There's a huge bridge over there. Nice. Wow, that's enormous. I've never seen anything like it before. Like, not this again. Can't you give it a rest? Oh, what do you mean? Give what a rest? Oh, Gagumon keeps talking about how he wants to be like all this stuff he sees. Yep, I want to be super big, just like that bridge. Why, you see what I mean? You guys are funny like that. Don't you think it's weird, Takuma? Yeah, though it's hardly the only strange thing about them. You got me there. The fact that they even exist is pretty strange. <laughs> You're too kind. Like, that wasn't a compliment. I've been having so much fun with Florimon and the others that it's easy to forget. But we still don't really have any idea what they are. Yeah, that's the kind of question I wish the professor were here to answer. Not that I can say that in front of Saki. Dunks is a tired boy. He is napping. Hey, my dude! Uh-oh, he's sad again. A big surprise! You alright, Ryo? If... If we get attacked here, this time, this time, I'm d d d d it's okay. I don't sense anything dangerous nearby. What? Shut up. Leave me alone. Can't. Like you even care what happens to me. Just go on and leave me alone. That's not going to happen. We're not leaving anyone behind. Remember this when he was going to have like the Grinch voice, whatever the fuck that means? That's what the professor wanted, so I, I owe that to him too. Yeah, I feel the same way. We're not about to just leave you alone. No man left behind. I don't want to lose another person the way we lost the professor. Damn it, just shut up. He's gone. And now he's back to mumbling under his breath again. At least he's keeping pace. Hopefully that's a good sign. What champion did you get for Agumon? I got Tyranimon. This is a good reminder. Uh, casual reminder for everyone. No spoilers whatsoever, including saying, Oh, well, if you had done this, you would have gotten this thing instead. Because I'm still going to do the other paths in my free time. So no spoilers at all. We've covered quite the distance. The tower's on top of this mountain, right? It sure is. Hmm, look, there's someone over there. Is that... He's getting bitches? Bro? It's Kaito. It is? I like how Dunks got in just like the super inconvenient position to keep me from doing the uh, Kaito voice just as Kaito appears. Oh, what a relief. I'm so glad he's okay. Wait, there's someone with him. Who could that be? That is an Aru Kinemon in disguise. Oi. You, what did you do with Mio? And you better give me a straight answer, or you're not gonna like what happens next. Huh? Oh, when will you get it through your skull that I don't have to tell you anything? Why, you little fine, you asked for this. Kaito, yeah, I'm happy I got Tyranimon. Huh? Kaito, you're alright. It's so good to see you. Guys, help me out. This lady. Help, please. Huh? Oh, this boy came out of nowhere and started screaming at me. I don't know why. Stop lying. I know you're a monster in disguise. Kaito, stop. What's going on? Sorry, I'm immediately sus. Of another human being here. Also, you just look like fucking Aru Kenimon. Hey, nice to meet you. I'm Drakmon, Kaido's partner. I'm Agumon, Takuma's partner. 
And I'm Takuma, Agumon's partner. Nice to meet you. Pleasure's all mine. Now, I'd better explain why things are so messed up. Kaito and Miyu were going through the forest together. Then Kaito went to scout ahead. He came back and Miyu was gone, so he started looking for her. And this is where I come in. Dragon offered to help right away, so I knew he must be alright. Bro, they gave like two hours for free time and Dragon gets this. Not even a voiced intro. Wow, dude, Dragon's about to get killed off. Wow, that was kind of a snap judgment. Although, I guess it worked out this time. But <laughs> anyway, I started helping Kaido look for Miyu, and then that woman, human woman showed up. Yeah, you can't really censor like you can the rest of us. Yeah, true, but some of us can mask our presence, so I'm not sure you can go by that. So what are you going by? Instinct. And I trust Kaito, which means I trust his instinct too. But is that really good enough? What if you're wrong? Ha, <laughs> then we can just apologize. Well, I guess that's one way of looking at it. Better to ask forgiveness than of approval. All right, we got a lot. Of, we got a lot to discuss here. Who all can we talk to? The Iron Bridge, of course. Rio, I need your immediate opinion. She she looks just like her. Who is she? What's Kaido complaining about? Who looks like who, Rio? Who she look like, Rio? I have no idea. We'll just have to find out. What, really? Not that I care. Kim. Who she look like, Rio? Rio, who she look like? Who does she look just like? What do you make of that woman? Why do you think she's arguing with Kaito? I have no idea. We'll just have to find out. Yeah, sounds about right. Well, ready to get to it, Takuma? Oh, uh, you're coming too, right? You're not just putting this all on me, are you? What? <laughs> no way. Like, well, it sounds like a huge pain to me. Count me out. Rio, you better not. <laughs> hey, no fair. If you're not going, then neither am I. Both of you come give me a hand. Like, wait. What do you mean? What do you make of that woman? Why do you think she's arguing with Kaito? I have no idea. We'll just have to find out. I think so. Good luck, Takuma. What? You're leaving this to me? Yeah, man. I can't talk to someone that pretty. It makes me super nervous. Minoru, when you speak so casually, it just makes it obvious that you're being insincere. I'm doing it on purpose, okay? But what does the bridge have to think of this situation? Vi, are you telling me your mother's eyes were fucking demon eyes? A large iron bridge has been built between the mountains. Seems odd to me. There shouldn't be any roads for cars to travel on in the mountain trail we used. It's for walking. Or what do you think of this situation? Are either you concerned about Kaito and that woman fighting? No. Nah. Hey, Kaito's a friend. I think you should at least be a little concerned. You keep talking about Kaito. Who is he? Huh? We've never met him. Never. What? Oh, right. You never. That's right. We just stopped talking about them for like three episodes. That's. Bro, that's my bad, bro. Is he really a friend? Sure, he's not a monster. Don't worry. He's definitely a friend. I don't fucking know, Kaido. What are you talking about, bro? You're doing a lot of vouching for a guy we've met once. What do you make of that woman? Why do you think she's arguing with Kaito? I'm supposed to ask you that. I have no idea. We'll just have to find it out. So good luck, Aoi. We should start by hearing what they have to say. Good thinking, Aoi. That's just what we should do. And then... Shuji, I don't really care what you think, but... What do you make of that woman? Why do you think she's arguing with Kaito? I have no idea. We'll just have to find out. Yes, asking about that sounds like a good place to start. Takuma, do you think you can handle this? What, me? I'll go with you, of course, but I think you're the best one for the job. Can I count on you to take care of this? Okay, I'll do what I can. Good luck. Thanks. I trust Kaito and his instinct. Alright. Very, very straight up to the point. Alright, we are absolutely going to hear from you first. This woman just showed up and started talking to me, and she was holding Miu's purse. That's awfully suspicious. Oh, yeah, what about Miu? You're right, I don't see her anywhere. Where is she? I don't know. We stayed together for a while, and I left for one second. She was gone. Takuma, I think you're sociopaths, so you can handle it. That's awful. And this woman comes out of nowhere with some of Miu's stuff. 
That does seem suspicious, but why call her a monster in disguise? Everything we've met so far has been a monster. What makes you think she's not? I'm not sure that's logical. Oh, you see? He's convinced, and I don't know what to do. I only spoke to him because he's the only soul I saw nearby. Well, what say you? Don't tell me you're buying that bull. I'm so sad Lotmon basically suffering in domestic abuse. I feel so bad. I feel so bad for both Kunamon and Lotmon, but at least Kunamon and, like, Ryo are starting to get along. Hmm... Oh, wow, a little, little bit of big thinky here. Let's go talk to the un unfamiliar woman. A.K.A. Aru Kinemon. I was out walking not far from my house, when suddenly I was surrounded by a strange fog, and the next thing I knew I was lost. Not just lost, I was somewhere I'd never seen before. I kept walking until I saw this boy. As for this purse, it was lying by the path. I was going to return it if I found the owner. Hmm. Nothing. Uh, nothing like that sounds off to me. Excuse me. While well, Lotmon gets a shut up every three minutes, dude. Exactly. Me neither. You're both stupid and ignorant. The fact that she even has amused purse is off. Kaito, relax. Could you please stay quiet for just a minute? The one thing that does seem strange to me is her ability to be safe without a monster. Monster? What do you mean, monster? Uh, we're surrounded by them. You're playing a little too ignorant right now. Who are you calling a monster? Oh my. Oh, what could that be? Hmm, that seemed more like an act than actual surprise. Maybe I'm overthinking it. It's a lie. Everyone who gets into this world showed up near the shrine. To be fair, we don't know that. Because it's only our group. Mew didn't even have a purse. Shut up, Frosty. We're baiting her out. Uh, uh. Hmm? What is it, Ryo? Mommy. Uh, excuse me? Oh, uh, she reminds me of my mother. She's a good person. I'm sure of it. Alright, Ryo? Bias. Can't be trusted. I'm sorry to say that about you. Right. Anyway. Um... I will listen to your opinion first. Kaito and that woman are saying completely different things. Whose story do we trust? Well, I think we should hear more from Kaito. Good thinking, Aoi. That's just what we should do. Labramon, is that all you know how to say now? So, what makes you say that? Right, now, it's just my intuition. I'm more inclined to trust Kaito since he's a friend. That and that woman's story just seems a little too convenient. She's, like, very blatantly lying. Alright. Oh, I didn't mean to talk to you. Sorry about that. We should hear more from Kaito. Oh, thank you for keeping it short when I didn't mean to talk to you. Uh... What what say you, Saki? Kinda looks like Siakamon's blob form. Ugh, cough, cough, foreshadowing! Kaito and that woman are saying completely different things. Whose story do we trust? Hmm, why don't we ask about the woman's story? Why do you suggest that? Just a feeling, you know? Besides, it's not like there were any holes in her story. What the fuck are you talking about? More importantly, I can't stand how Kaito just refuses to listen. He keeps going on and on about not trusting her. It's like he's got tunnel vision. Uh. Like, haha, <laughs> that's a funny face you're making, Saki. It's all scrunched up. Oh, come on. Don't look at me when I get like this. Well, I do see what you're saying. Alright, so this is like... I fucking disagree extremely. Maybe we'll talk to Kaito first. I don't know. Wait, God, I keep mixing them up. I don't know, man. I don't know because she had some of Mio's stuff. Seems kind of no real flimsy. What the fuck are you talking about? Kaito, are you sure you're at jumping to conclusions? What about what she has to say? Oh, come on, guys. Takuma, you must be able to see that something's not quite right here. Uh, well, I don't think we know enough yet to say for sure. Wait, hold on a minute. Didn't the professor say only children get offered as sacrifices? the fuck does that have to do with anything, Alan? Are you implying only children can come here? Because the professor was even older than this woman. And if so, doesn't that make it strange for there to be an adult here? That's bad logic, Alan. I'm on your side. That's bad logic. Hmm? Yeah, you're right. I can't believe this is going to be the gotcha moment because the fucking professor was with us. Bro, I can 
see it hurts from just from looking at her. I'm not so sure. I mean, those sacrifices might not have anything to do with this. Besides, the professor was brought here as an adult. Maybe it's not that strange. Oh, right. Hmm. Who cares about some random disappearances? She did something to Miu. Ah, this is getting so old. Would you give it a rest? Why are we able to talk to Shuji? Who gives a shit what Shuji says right now? This woman is totally suspicious. Don't you trust her? Hmm? Oh, how can I clear things up for you? I'll believe you. Well then, <laughs> thank you. Yes, mommy. Look, Kaito, if you don't trust her, what's the alternative? Could you lay it out for us? Rio shooting down the rankings in world record fashion. What? Don't give me that. If you screw with me, I will mess you up. What's snapping at people? See, this is the problem with you, Kaito. You refuse to budge and just harass people until you get your way. I don't want to hear this. This isn't about my problems, okay? Oh, please stop fighting. But, okay, who has not shit opinions? Child? I guess we'll talk to you guys now. What did you turn your Betamon into? Based-ass Deltamon, bro. Base Deltamon king. Kaito and that woman are saying completely different things. Whose story we trust? Well, if you ask me, we should talk more with that woman. Why's that? I mean, just look at her. Man, she even smells nice. Haha, <laughs> Minoru, you look funny. Your whole face is red. Minoru, be serious. I am serious. It's not like I'm deciding based on looks because I'm so confused. Alright, okay. I think I see where you're coming from. And it sucks. It's a fucking bad opinion, Minoru. Uh, holding yet another L. Shuji? Kaito and that woman are... Okay, who do we trust? In my opinion, we should hear a bit more from Kaito. Why do you say that? Well, I realize we don't have enough information to really come to a decision. But like I said before, that one being alone out here seems weird to me. I think it's weird that she could survive in this world of monsters all on her own? Exactly! Every few hours is a crisis. How could she be so calm out here by herself? If it were me on my own, I'd have lost it by now. Shuji! Huh. I like how they did not even fucking try to have, like... Oh, here's an interesting argument for the woman. Here's an interesting argument for the man. It's like, hey, here's a bunch of flaws in her story. Uh, she has titties. They really didn't try with this one. Are you gonna get a Betamon to get yourself a Tuskmon? Because he's a cool boy. If I come across a Betamon and I get another one, I will. But I'm not trying to do too many free battles. I'm trying to get one of each Digimon if I can. But free battles are just so fucking boring and take forever. I hate doing them. You monster. What'd you do with Mio? I keep trying to tell you. I don't know. Cut the crap! Admit it. You kidnapped her, didn't you? Eep. Please don't hurt me. Kaito, stop. What is wrong with you? There's no need to resort to violence. Yeah, help me stop Kaito. Right. And then her spider legs shoot out of her spine. Let go of me. She took her. She took Mio. Or even if she didn't, she knows something. Enough, you need to calm down. Kaito, there's no need to hurt anyone. Relax. <sighs> Fine, I'll stop. Let go of me. Phew, what a relief. And then he rushes her immediately. <laughs> immediately transforms into Aru Kinemon. On the spot. All right, everybody. Chatting's nice and all, but how much time have you got to spare? Yeah, we really should be getting to the tower. What about you, Kaido? I've got a fine meal, so come on. Let's get this over with. Oh, Jesus! He did his sonic blast! Hey, relax. You don't have to get so worked up over every little thing. What an incorrigible brute. You said it. So what do we do? I mean, it's either we believe Kaido or this woman, right? Well, she's right. Mommy's right. Cute, cute. To be honest, I'm not sure how much I trust her. But if she knows the way to the tower, it'd be great if she could show us. That's a good point. Regardless of who we believe, we have to keep our goal in mind. Sonic Boom. 
Yeah, it'd be great to have a guide. After all, I'd hate to get lost out here. But, but didn't Agumon and the others already make it up there? What? Oh, I don't know the way. What? You don't? I apologize if we misled you, but we only saw the tower from afar. You mean we could have gotten lost at any time? That just makes it even better. Now we can have her show us the way. Like, yeah, let's do that! We sure don't want to get lost! Wait, you actually want to trust this liar? That's the monster that kidnapped me. I'm telling you, you've got it all wrong! Oh great, here we go again. Takuma, I think it's time we made a decision. Are you gonna do a different round of this game, taking different options? Eventually, I don't know if it'll be on stream or my free time. It depends on how long the game is. Leaning towards in my free time right now. This woman knows the way to the tower, but she does seem kind of suspicious. Kaido's a friend, but he's not making much sense and seems pretty hung up about Miyu. I fully, like... I, I agree with the idea that if she can take us to the tower, that's useful. She has not told us she can take us to the tower. We're just making that shit up. I just kind of believe him. Her story doesn't... She Also, she's literally acting on me. Like, our character pointed that out. Yes. Okay. Weird, silent moment. You guys just don't get it. Whatever. I'll find Mew. Even if that means I have to do it alone. Uh, did the game just ignore my decision? Did the game, like, actually literally just ignore my decision? So long, then! What? Hey, you can't just leave! Man, I wish he wasn't so stubborn. I'll go reason with him. You guys go on ahead. Takuma, not you too. Don't you walk off like that. Oh, this character who doesn't even have a profile won't be a baddie. No, not really. You can get to the tower just fine without Ogmon. Okay, I guess that decision was me going off to follow them. Or follow him. I guess them, because Dragmon's with him. Or Darkmon. Wait, it's Dragmon. But it might take a while to take talk to Kaito, so meanwhile, check things out. Right, you got it, Takuma. We're coming too! Haru, Miyuki. Man, if I don't hurry, I'm gonna lose Kaito. I can't stop to argue about this. Fine, but stay with me, okay? Let's go, Agumon. Aw, oh, yeah! Alright, I don't like losing most of the group here, but no man left behind. We have to go after Kaito. Ah, oh, hey there! We meet again! What's up? Huh? Huh? What are you doing coming after me? Don't give me that. Why do you always have to act on your own? Hey, you're the one who followed me. What are you calling that? Not letting a man behind. One who I wasn't sure I'd ever see again. Oh, is that so? What about the half prints? They your back up? Half pint? Sorry. Half pint, sorry. Oh, right, you haven't met these two yet. This is Haru and this is Miyuki. We've been sticking together. Bye. Hi. Sure, whatever. Just remember, you're the one who wanted to follow me. You better not slow me down. Cool. Alright, we got the boys all together. There's a lot to look at. Let's look at... I probably should have done this Um. also at bridge area. I'm sure I've missed important lore. I'm sure I've get broken the game. Now I'm getting the, the super negative bad ending. Because I didn't use phone on bridge. Oh, a whole lot of boo seed. That's pretty pogger. Da, 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 There's another one here. What's this? There's ribs. I found them in the woods. I think I'm going to draw one. Would you be best buzz? I don't know why. I have a feeling it'll be later in the game. Alright, I'm gonna assume that's speculation and not. Haha, uh -huh, I'm gonna say a thing that's a spoiler. I'm gonna think about it. Hmm, what's this? Uh, more ribs, wow. The fuck is. Is it? Why are there so many ribs out here, bro? Alright, who wants to talk? Hey, I found something! It's not something weird, is it? 
Like monster droppings? Gross. Gross. It's not monster droppings. Come on. Uh, what is it then? Oh. I wonder if we can use this. It's gotta be good for something. We need to use everything we can to Digimon survive. That's true. Good job finding us, Agumon. Well, that's neat. Oh, was that plot progression for some reason? Oh, what the fuck? Oh, I just missed all of the dialogue. Well, say la vie. Wow, it's an actual cable car! What a curious device. Someone got slaughtered and their ribs went everywhere. No, Mummy Mon. It looks every bit as run down and decrepit as that school. Does this thing actually work? The cars run automatically on a schedule. One should be here soon. Wait, you mean there's electricity here? There wasn't any at the school. I bet it's some other weird power source. Not so far-fetched compared to our little pals. So this thing runs automatically? Are you sure it won't drop us halfway to the top? Why would this lady know this? She's nothing but sus. Her character trait is sus. You're absolutely right. She has two character traits. Number one, sus. Number two, she looks like Aru Kinemon. What? There's no way I'm getting on that thing. Like, yeah! A fall from that height and even I'd be done for! We could fall? That would be terrible. We'd better not ride on it. Don't worry. The cars and the cable are both quite sturdy. Nothing's ever broken them. Yes. <sighs> That's a relief. Is there no one else here? I'd expect there would at least be a maintenance worker. Oh no, I never found anyone else. Is that a problem? No, just something I was wondering about. Oh, well, you're, the still, you're not still suspicious, are you? Number three, boobs. <laughs> you can see she's been telling the truth. Is it about time we started trusting her? I'm not so sure. Well, just look at Ryo. He seems to have warmed right up to her. Mommy. Oh, my. <laughs> Cute. See, what's not to trust? She's been nothing but helpful. And that's after the way Kaito treated her. She's gotta be real nice. Well, I suppose. Got some dumb fucks. Okay, everyone, the car is here. I've never been on a cable car before. This is kind of exciting. I love your voice for Lambermon. Thank you. Get in, everybody. This will take us straight to the tower. <laughs> sus. 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 Do you get it? Sus smirk. I'm worried about Minoru and the others, but I can only go ahead with Kaito for now. Jigsaw music. Do do do. Do do do. Do 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 do. Oh, did I get that cutscene because I looked at the sus thicket? Th was that a secret cutscene I got for looking at the sus thicket? Does it still say that even though I've already looked there? Oh, it respawned everything? It's just a burly man with a Russian accent. Oh, yeah. More ribs, baby. More ribs. Let's freaking go. We're grinding items here. What's this? What's this? I found ribs in the woods. Dude, if I ever have to use ribs for something. That was a pink Agumon! Did you see that? Bro, remember when we thought Boss was gonna be the mon who making stompy stomps? Dude, it might still be. Because Aru Kinemon is an ultimate, so that could be setting up a, a future fight. Someone died again. This is pretty clear cut for just a game trail. Do humans have a hand in this? Pat seems to be heading towards the summit. Um, what do you have to say? Man, I am. Am I bored? I wish we get attacked or something. Hey, you don't say things like that. I prefer not getting attacked. You don't get it. Boredom is like poison. It saps your will and to live and slowly pull you towards death. Stop creeping me out, would you? 
Don't let him get to you, Takuma. He likes to mess with people, so I'll say random stuff and wait for a free action. Hey, that's not fair! I very often mean every word that I say. And did you mean what you said just now? Nope! See. Haha, <laughs> well, it's clear you two get along. Mm hmm. Are you okay, sis? You're not too tired? Okay. Alright, if it starts taking too hard, let me know. Okay. It must have been tough for them going up, uh, up to the mountain. I'll need to be ready for help, too. I'll need to be ready to help, too. And go again? Watch out for the spot, okay, Miyuki? See how it sticks out? Okay. Here, hold my hand so you don't fall. Okay. Haru sure does a great job looking after his sister. Yeah, it's really impressive. Mia used to be just like that. Really? She was? Never mind. Forget it. Oh, yeah. Bonus lore, baby. Bonus lore. New cutscene unlocked. Flashback. Flashback! And now that we all, we've unlocked the secret cutscenes of their fate, we'll know how to find their bodies. Wow, we're up so high. Oh, let me look too. Hey, we're not out here for the fun of it. Try to stay alert. Oh, relax, Juju. We're practically there. That's the harm in having a little fun. But, but... Disaster could strike at any moment. You must remain vigilant. Like, oh, you're so strict. Don't you get tired of being on high alert all the time? And they all died here because we went with Kaito. I hate hides. <laughs> it's all right, everyone. We're almost there. When we get to the tower, our cell phone should work. Then we can call for help. Yeah, and this whole wilderness survival nightmare will finally be over. Yes. Soon it will all be over. Wow, what a normal and not suspicious thing to say. The radio tower is up and running, isn't it? So why didn't you stick around there? Why indeed. <laughs> huh? What are you... If you want something done right, I suppose you must do it yourself. Huh? Did, did you just... You know, I really am very grateful to all of you. I feel like I should thank you. Oh, don't mention it. Honestly, I'm not even sure why you'd feel that way. Why? Because even if that one little brat got away, now you're all here instead. And there are so many of you. I can't thank you enough. What? What's got into you? I don't get it. <laughs> oh, don't worry. I'll be sure to catch your other little friend, too. What are you talking about? Mommy? Although I suppose this is the end of the line for you. <laughs> is everyone okay? What happened? Like I hit my head! It seems like nobody has any major injuries. Uh, is it just me, or does something seem wrong? The car. It's not moving. Huh? That woman. She's gone. Mon, what? Seriously? Y yeah, and here's where we cut to Aru Kinemon walking on the cable wire as a giant spider. Ryo, look behind you! Huh? What? Uh-oh. Wow. <laughs> it was exactly fucking right. Eek! Oh man, a spider! Again! What is that thing? A demon? A demon spider woman? Oh no, 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 no! It's huge! Wait, what happened to that woman? Not very bright, are you? Or was my disguise just that good? Don't you know better than to trust a stranger? She's smiling. 
Oh, so creepy. I am Aru Kinemon. But don't worry, you won't need to remember my name for long. Because you're all about to die. <laughs> yes, I will offer up everyone in this box as sacrifices. So I will say, for those of you unaware, um, this is a extremely minor spoiler because it will be as obvious as this was. In Digimon Adventure 2, Aru Kinemon is in that as a villain, uh, and she takes a human disguise. Uh, they basically just reused her human disguise from Digimon Adventure 2. Like, they changed it slightly, but it's basically the same fucking disguise. <laughs> oh no, what are we gonna do, Shuji? This is why I didn't want to go exploring! Wah, yeah! Oh, I shitted myself! No. No, mommy. That's not... That's not my mommy. Of course not. <laughs> of course not. Really what this tells me is that even if we chose to trust her options, it just loops back to the scene, but Kaito still comes to help us. Mommy's not here. Flashback to his mom's death. Nope, never mind. Wow, we sure have been standing in this open field for a while. Oh. Miyuki, what is it? Hmm, is something wrong? What are you looking at, Miyuki? Oh, okay, they're in their fucking safe then. Looks like the game will go on. It stopped part way up! Looks like everyone's trapped inside! Wait, so this was all of that woman's plan? <laughs> I knew she was a monster, what I tell you. What's gonna happen to them? We need to get over there and save them. Right, let's go! Kill me in. I'm gonna smash that monster woman's face in. Come on, Drakmon. You got it! I love his eye hands. Really what's fucked is I could have evolved someone into early into her early, but instead I just vamp doggo. Crazy it isn't locked off. Yeah, but it's not like she's like overpowered or anything, so I feel like locking her off would just spoil she's gonna be a villain. You're the reason this whole world is falling apart! But by sacrificing human children, we can prevent its destruction. We will be saved. I thought all might be lost when that little girl with the hat got away. But now I can offer up all of you instead. Those feet were definitely still Cyclone Mon, and he will be the villain of the next chapter. So wait, this is that woman? A sneak attack, huh? What a coward. Takuma, get ready for some action. We're gonna stomp this giant bug and save everyone. Right. Let's do this, Agumon. Yeah! Oh, thankfully we have- Oh no, it is still spider area. We only get to bring one friend with us? We're gonna be fine. We all learned Digimon on Wikipedia like you. Time for slow, tedious battle. Now hold on, hold on. A little help here? What a pain. All the horses, we're coming to help. Now hold on, hold on. I'm closest, so guess I'm up first. Let me at him. I don't really need the commentary over my own fight. Alright, we're gonna real quick from here to say. And we're going to drop the sound of two. For actual battles. Okay. Um. You're going to be our crowd control, Deltamon. Well, I guess, like. What's an orb? I can send both of you this way. Where's your attack? Okay, it's 
a, it's a good around the area kind of thing. Bring the fucking dinosaur Omnimon. Ogamon, you're gonna start heading this way. You're gonna come off. Can't attack through him? That's interesting. Alright. Also crazy they resorted using spider again. Ah. This is a bit different than what I thought it was. Attack anything down there. Okay, so it wasn't that I couldn't attack through him, it's the fact that he was on a different level. So this will just kill you. This will also just kill you. Absolutely eviscerate. Alright, that's probably the only fight you're gonna be a part of, my good sir. I feel like I could just... Is there like a benefit to stopping you? I feel like maybe there is. You don't evolve yet, do you? Oh, you sure do! You sure do just evolve! That's weird. Oh wow, Dragmon already got his evolution. They said fuck Dragmon's anime moment. Dude, Dragmon's just built it. Pretty strong. It's a little bit of a strong boy. I don't need that chest. What I need is to start making my way down here. Yeah, I don't know how I feel about Dragmon being vampire dog. Oh, he's making his move.
Not a big fan of this being its evolution, to be honest with you. I think I want you to have the high ground on this one. Can I attack downward? Yes. Ooh, Bloodsucker ability. It actually is a vampire dog. Damn. I blocked the wrong direction. I thought you couldn't get up there. Uh-oh, I've been poisoned. That's not good. So this would get rid of your poison, right? Yes. Oh, but now you can't attack? That's an interesting thing I hadn't considered. We're gonna go here. We're gonna block this way. You can't block after using an item either? That's a little... I don't know how to feel about that decision. gonna talk and we're gonna get the all stats boost on me because I need it we need to make sure this one dies yeah we're gonna get rid of it. Oh, it's a healing bot? Oh, that's super good? Okay, wait, that's like based as hell. All right. I think we want to move here to stay in range of the healing. And I think we want a big bandage on can't. Okay. Oh, uh, let's, let's eat ribs. Bro, I love the two Digimon that require for this are weak to them. In turn and face them. Okay. Yeah, the play is item. Big band. attack and then we're gonna go ahead and boost ourselves probably should have waited till I was gonna attack to do this I wasn't really thinking to be honest and we're doing it this way because now Deltamon can come down here and pop off a triple forces and just absolutely obliterate him So I think we want to move. I think we want to move here. I think a fireball reaches. It doesn't. I don't want to destroy you. We will item up with another ribs, so we can start launching fireballs soon. And we will in turn this way. I just attack you from the side. You will take a lot of damage. That will not kill you, and I can't reach you yet, so I'm just gonna attack you normally. 
get a little bit of heal in there too. Uh, and we're gonna block you in case you try to jump. Because, yep, we can just... Nuke you. That's fine. You're doing okay. This is where Aru Kinemon comes for me? Yep. Now that did hit hard. That did hit hard. Um... We are gonna move to the side of her and attack with fire breath. Get a nice crit on there. We're gonna move to the side of you. And we're gonna attack with sticker blade. Ah, uh, okay. You... Eat ribs. I dare say this mega sucks. It's a rough one. It's a rough one. I don't know what Arter Kingmon's gonna do. Oh, she's gonna go from behind me? You know what? That was a pretty good maneuver on her part. Oh, he's dead. I see. Um, we are going to item. What are my con win conditions here? Okay, so as long as Deltamon lives, I will still be fine. We are going to big bandage. And then we are going to start making our way to Aru King. Definitely gonna item and bandage up again. And go here. Deltamon, you are in admittedly in a little bit of trouble here. But I still believe in you. She's coming in. I'll take that back. We're gonna move, and here's why. I want to kill this other spider before I kill Aru Kinemon in case I get something for saving the dude blocking them. Or for killing the guy that's like guarding them in case I get something from doing this. Which it seems like I did. I thought I was done for. Thanks for the save. Oh! Okay. Okay, so we're like definitely gonna win it now. Now then, time for a little payback. Okay, so the strategy was definitely to free them first and then go after Aru Kinemon, but we're fine either way. Speed. 
down. There's no reason to not use your evolutions immediately. Why does your mom let you have three megas? It's okay. The gang is all fine now. We're gonna be good. Deltamon might go down here, but he honest to god, never mind he's a champion. He's a fucking absolute lad. I guess that's what happens when you run. Sorry, I wanted to go. I guess this is what happens when you run an ultimate versus nothing but champions. But at least we were able to get that. Fuck. Oh, let's go. Axe Star Ukinimon chopped her head off. How frustrating! For all that I was holding back, I do not like losing to these brats. She was holding back? And she was still that tough? She was just toying with us? <laughs> Not exactly. I simply wasn't motivated to fight with all I had. And I had the ceremony already, too. Oh, well. After all, I needn't be the one to make the offering. Alright, enough of your babbling. What'd you do with the girl you kidnapped earlier? Do you really still not get it? I'm under no obligation to tell you anything! So even now you're trying to pull that crap? Maybe you haven't felt enough pain. Kaito, I don't think violence is the answer here. Maybe she isn't telling you because she just doesn't know. What? <laughs> Aren't you a clever one? You're smarter than you look! Big jump from Kaito. Careful, Kaito! Don't get too close! There's only one reason she'd be dragging this out. She's got something up her sleeve. Oh, give this one a prize. But first, let me bid you adieu. What? Uh, damn it, she got away again. That monster. Well, you did all you could. No wonder she was so smug. She was sure she could get away. And she did. I wonder if that's why she didn't feel motivated to go all out. Who knows? Maybe there was some reason she had to pretend to put up a fight. Well, we can worry about that later. Let's focus on climbing the tower for the moment. Wow, how extremely relevant to everything. Deltamon. Continuing to become so based, so strong. Deltamon carried that fight. It's gonna be real tough when I have to choose what to digivolve Deltamon into. It's gonna be a real hard choice. Just pulled a Fangmon on us. We're gonna make a very bold guess here. Hold up. Give me a second. Help! Somebody help, please! Huh? I thought I heard a voice just now. You don't think it's that Aryukinimon again, do you? No, they were calling for help. I thought I heard it coming from around here. Fangmon at least said, oh, fuck it, I'm outnumbered. Yeah, he said three on one was bullshit. Well, if it's help after, it's help they'll get. Wait, you don't even know who it is. What if they want to take advantage of us? Oh, don't be like that. We should help them. 
Shut up! Nobody asked you! What if we made them agree not to attack us in exchange for our help? Like, yeah, but don't stop there! We could tell them to give us all their food, too! That might as well be robbery. Hey, I found him! I have guessed incorrectly. Help. It's Tent- It's Tentamon! No need to worry about him! The poor thing's caught in a spider web! I mean, fuck, yeah, dude, what? No man left behind, and that includes Tenemon. We should get him out of there. Agumon thinking cut through those threads? No problem! No man left behind includes everyone? Oh, I'm saved. Thank you so much for helping me. Mm, well, would you look at that? More human children. How unusual. More? Wait, you mean you've seen others? Right you are, and a lot smaller than the one behind you. Could that have been Mew? Was he, she walking around by herself? Who did you guess? We'll get to him. Well, she's been captured by that terrifying... She'd been captured by that terrifying Arukinimon, you see. I couldn't help but take pity on the girl, so I rescued her at the first opportunity. Unfor she said... Tintamon! He said no man left behind! Unfortunately, I was then discovered by Arukinimon and taken prisoner myself. Uh -huh. But what about Mew? What happened to the girl? The girl? Why, she ran away. I was right behind her, so there's no doubt about that. She was headed to that shiny place, you see? Okay, great. Thanks for telling me, and for rescuing Mew in the first place. Oh my, don't even mention it. So where exactly is this shiny place? I'm not sure how to describe it. Why, well, I got real close because I was do Kaito. Why not climb up somewhere and see for yourself? Oh, the Palace of Gold? Hey, you think we would be able to see it from the top of that tower? Good thinking. Let's go up and find out. Oh boy, a good look at the map. Now do 70 quick time events in a row to climb the tower. Phew, we finally made it. You know, I should have thought of this sooner, but what's that? How's that old cable car working? Where's the power coming from? Who's keeping it running? It doesn't make any sense. It's the same thing with the plumbing of the skull. Like, how does any of this work? Who cares? All I want to know right now is where me and went. Come on, let's go. Tentamon's being a real handyman. He's a real helpful guy. A real, real Chad. No man left behind mindset. It's a horrific noise. Wait, what the hell is this? This doesn't make any sense. Do do do, do 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 do. Why are we surrounded by water? This is supposed to be a mountain range. This is an island? Does that mean we actually got teleported here? This is all getting real crazy, real fast. Your school, the shrine, those buildings are all just like I remember. But the geography's all wrong. How did this happen? I... I can't believe this. I feel like I don't know what's what anymore. Everyone, we've gotta calm down. Uh... Shuji, you seem more upset than anyone. I like the transition between those two. It's like the exact same face. This can't be. It's a shock. Oh, it's a shocking sight for all of us, but it must be worse for Kaito being local. And Aoi is actually speechless. What's with the ocean? Why is this an island? Even some of those buildings are wrong. Wow, what that? Wow, what's that shiny thing? And that looks like a giant ring. Oh, is this what uh, Kunamon was trying to draw for us earlier? Check out that building covered with steel pipes over there. The roller coaster? At this point, we have to be in some other dimension, don't we? We're on a fucking island all along. Nobody's coming to save us. That's just what we'll have to accept, isn't it? You can't say that for sure. Come on, let's not give up just yet. But, but we... Oh. <laughs> Rio? I knew it. This isn't the real world, not a chance. <laughs> this, this is the afterlife. That's it. That's gotta be. 
Ryu, Ryu, come on, pull yourself together. We're all dead, all of us. But then again, what about mommy? Mommy's dead too, of course. That means she's here. I knew it was her. She's here for me, calling for me. Ryo, you're losing it. Get it together. This isn't the time or place to start panicking. In situations like this, it's important to keep a clear head and act with calm. Shut up! Oh, fuck. No, you don't have to hit me. Ryo, where do you think you're going? It's dangerous out there. This is bad. We have to stop him. Karma and evolution. Karma will affect Agumon's evolution. Oh, I tried to split the video there, but it failed. <laughs> it's fine. Everything's gonna be fine. I get it now. Mommy's here. I'm gonna go see my mommy. Mommy! Mommy, it's me! <laughs> Help me! Oh, there's Cyclomon. Oh, you poor little boy. I thought the whole story was going to happen in an unknown, thick, and deadly digital forest. You want to see your mommy that badly? Then come right over here, you poor baby. Uh, you, you're fake. You're not my mommy. You betrayed me. Oh, that's right. Kunamon still has a Digivolve. Mommy would never betray me. Never. She'd be there to save me no matter what. Don't you see? I'm gonna meet my mom. You got that? Mommy, save me. What? Have you lost your mind completely? Shut up. I'm not talking to you. I'm talking to mommy. Get lost. Mommy, I've tried so hard for so long. I've been wanting to see you so badly. Come get me, mommy. Come quickly. <laughs> My, my, what a shame. I do believe this child's broken. Now what to do with him? I suppose I ought to perform the ritual and offer him as a sacrifice. But that would make him a part of this world. Ah, that's why Haru and Miyuki are fine. What do you mean? He's clearly gonna die, he die here as this game is very serious. Yes, I suppose he'll just have to die. The real boss? A champion Digimon? Cyclone Mon, come here, would you? Oh, yes. Lady Aruginimon. Do, 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 do. Kill this boy for me, would you? It should be easy enough. I'll leave it to you. Yes, my lady. Very good. I shall return to the altar then. He's yours. Ryo became a hyena. I will kill the boy. Oops. Huh? What the? Hey, stop! What's going on? Mommy! What? Stay still. You're so hard to hold. I'll drop you from here. That'll kill you for sure. Help me, Mommy! Shut up. Take this. Ah! Ah, mommy, mommy, save me, mommy! Yeah, stupid boy. Time to end you, Rio. Mm. Kunamon, it's time. How? What is that thing? A huge one-eyed monster. That is Cyclone Mon, a brute concerned only with his own power. Like, don't let the size of him scare you. He's a total buffoon. Eek, is Rio well, still all right? He's trying to resist. He'll st he's still okay. Then we need to save him fast. I shit in myself. Cute. Kunamon says he wants us to save Ryo. We're on it. Don't worry, Kunamon. We'll save him. Haru, Miyuki, stay back. This could be dangerous. Okay. Okay. I didn't mean run away. Alright, everybody. Let's do this. The real boss fight. 
All right, so base Deltamon immediately thrown in. We have to have Ogremon. Um, and if I get one other choice, oof, oof, e. Um, Kunamon, you're gonna help us save your brother. That's the way to do it. Anime executives, bro, we can't have two big boss fights in episode three. You're actually somewhere right. I actually need to very seriously take a bathroom break. I was really waiting for the chapter split. Uh, but we're going to take a short three to five minute bathroom break. I will return.